Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome to my channel. It's Diecast Wolf. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to get the mail-in for uh, Target. And this can work for any other mail-ins. I ended up getting my first mail-in from the Dollar General exclusive. Pretty much follow the same process. By the end of the video, you're going to know what exactly what to do, what to look for. Let's get right into it. Okay, step number one is go on MattelCreations.com. Under the Brands tab, go under Hot Wheels Collectors, and then from there, go on News. Once you go on the News, go on Public News Stories. This is where you're going to find all the information on what's going on with Hot Wheels, you know, RLCs, anything that's popped up. Uh, so here's, here is the Target Mini Cooper. Just click on that and this is where it's going to give you all the instructions on how to get this mail in so it's very important to see the promotion dates uh which here has september 3rd to october 14th uh you don't want to be doing this when it's october 15th and trying to buy hot wheels knowing that you're not going to be able to get it what you need to do is buy mainline cars uh, multi packs, uh, and here's the numbers that you need to look for on the back of the card or the multi pack and see if they match up. It's very important. You can't just go to Target and just buy anything Hot Wheels and expect um, for that to work to equal out 20 bucks. I mean, you could do it easily, but um, it needs to match these codes right here. So I'm working to get the mail in myself. I got a couple of uh, cards right here. These two are five pack. When they say UPC, this is what you need. So you got the number right there, the one, uh, sorry, the 01806. And here, that is the same number, which is just the code. And that's what they're gonna accept. Same thing with the cards, number, l2593 there it is again l2593 so you need to have a codes that match up to what they have here on the website all right so here's an example of why you need to pay attention so here's an ultra hot sell these in target there is the code hd g52 and as you can see that code is not on here. So if you don't pay attention, you're buying all these cars to get the mail in, come to find out, you just wasted your money. The collectors that open everything, you guys have no problem. Uh, if you can buy Hot Wheels in any other stores, just make sure that you're matching up the code with the website. For the collectors that open some of the stuff, um, it's best to keep these cards for mail-ins. This right here is my stack that I've been just saving because there are some cards that I don't want to open. So in their place, I use a card that I did open. I always check to see if the code matches and I use it for mail-ins. And for the collectors that don't open anything, well, I hope you have a friend that does open their Hot Wheels, borrow their cards, take their cards, do what you got to do. What you're also going to need is the original receipts though, so don't throw those away. As you can see here on the website, they want the original receipts, no photocopies. Uh, they want to want to look for are the dates to see if you bought those cards uh, during the promotion dates. It also kind of tells you exactly you know what you need to do, which is they just need the back, pretty much just the card. They don't need the blister. Um, like I mentioned before, the UPC code, uh, if you have like multi-patch, which I uh, already showed you, and the receipt has to total $20 before taxes. So it can't be after, it needs to be before. So on the receipts, don't worry about this numbers, these numbers right here. Just worry about the price uh, and just remember uh, what you bought because these numbers right here, they don't match the five packs or even like the single cards. They yeah, just got to make sure that they all just total up uh, at least at least $20. So if it goes over, that's fine. Next, what you want to do is click on this link here. It's going to bring you up to another window. Select your country. I'm in the US. 
So this right here, you're pretty much just paying for the uh, shipping uh, when when they're gonna mail you the the car. So if you're if you have twenty dollars, it's gonna be one. Uh, if you have receipts total of uh, forty bucks, uh, if you're planning to get more than one of these cars, then you know you just pick you just pick your quantity right here. If it's one, if it's two, you know the deal. Continue with the checkout. Answer all your info. Uh, Let's see. I've already done it, but once you get the fourth page, uh, what you're gonna get is this receipt. You print it out. You gotta print it out, and uh, let me show you exactly what it looks like. So once you get to that last page on, on the on the website, this is what you're gonna get. So you, what you need to do is you need to cut this out, that little piece. You gotta put it in, on your envelope, and then you gotta cut out the larger piece, and you gotta put that in the envelope. So it's basically just for them knowing that you already paid for the shipping. Uh, at that point, you don't gotta do anything else. So once you got everything, just pretty much put everything in here. Put your cards in here your slip and your receipts. I'm gonna take this to the post office today and just wait for that Mini Cooper to come in. So that's it guys, it's pretty simple. Uh, I got it on my first try. If you like this video, give it a like, it helps the channel. Uh, if you have any other questions, leave some comments below. I'll try to answer all your guys' questions. Uh, I wanna make sure that you guys get this uh, Mini Cooper and anything else in the future. That's pretty much it guys. I appreciate you watching and don't forget to uh, like and subscribe. Thank you.